All right, so here it is out of the box. All you have to do is just, it's got nice braided USB cable. And there it is. So let's try it. Oh, wow. That's so nice. It fits in your hand just perfectly. Because I got pretty large hands. And I can reach the sniper button. I can reach the sniper button just fine. The wheel is with little bumps in between. I can press down, left and right, forward, backwards. Those are for adjusting DPI settings. Um, and there's two little buttons up here. So, that'll do it for my overview. Maybe I'll do some review on how it actually works on my computer. Thanks for watching. Alright, so one of the few things I didn't cover is there are lights built in. It's a blue kind of light. Um, the, that laser down there isn't actually visible, which is pretty cool. Um, these are weights, where you see those little, where my thumb is, those are weights, and you can remove them and adjust them to how you like. If I go on a server real quick, I know, Minecraft, how cliche, and I just to demonstrate what the mouse can do, right now I'm not holding any buttons down, right now I'm holding the sniper button down, and it won't let me go any faster, as you can see, I'm moving my hand like that. But now that I let go of this gaming, uh, the sniper button, and then look at me. It's all because of that sniper button right there that lowers DPI. Um, that lowers DPI also. So I can <coughs> move very little. If I wanted to, I could just move very little just by adjusting the down button. Or I could turn that up and move a lot just with clicking that up. So that concludes my overview. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, GregGamer34 here. Um, gonna do an unboxing and overview of this Corsair Vengeance M65 gaming mouse. Uh, we'll go over the box first. Uh, it has a sniper button for enhanced and precise targeting, which just lowers the DPI. Uh, comfortable and secure and con contoured fit in rugged aluminum construction. Uh, 8200 DPI gaming mouse, a uh, gaming sensor with on the fly resolution ad adjustment. Um, yeah, if we can look in the back here. There's the actual mouse itself. There's the sensor. Um, some more specs. It's rated to 20 million kick clicks on each side of the right and left uh, buttons. Um, yeah, and then there's some system requirements. All right, so let's open it up.